don't have to get an egg dying kit. No, no, not here at Barb's house. We die with new eggs. You probably already have Jello. You probably already have sprinkles because who doesn't? And you probably already have sparkle, sparkle, sparkle icing. And you definitely probably have mm, yummy eggs. So let's get to Easter egg decorating. Um, should I just start doing it now? So we're gonna pull one egg out. Oh, I didn't boil the eggs. They're just plain eggs. That's okay. Wow, stinky rules where you have to boil eggs before you dye them. We don't have to. That takes more time. Skip it. We just do it with regular eggs right out of the fridge. Open up your jello box. It reminds her of the sunshine and fun playing in the sun. And also pee pee. People like yellow and some people like green. Pretty, pretty green. I don't like green beans, I don't eat them. But this reminds me of green beans. Green and yellow, here we come. Let the egg get used to the jello. While those are soaking, I'm gonna do. <sighs> Wait, I didn't say that right. Um. So while those soak, we're gonna start out with my other way of decorating eggs with icing. You can eat icing, I love icing. Sometimes icing things are hard to open, but it's okay, don't get frustrated. Just think about fun things in life while you're trying. I thought of fun things. Okay, uh, oh, I think I have to cut the top open. Um, okay, let's tell it. Open up with my teeth, little icing. I hope it opens up with my teeth. It hurts a little bit, but we're getting there. So you're you're not gonna be able to do it with your teeth. You're gonna have to do it with scissors. That's okay, we try. So hold the egg up and ice it however you would like. I like to do funky styles. Just let your heart go and let it decorate. Woo, so pretty. Icing is nothing without sprinkles. Uh-oh. Um, I think you're supposed to keep the lid on. I spilled a little bit. And it's okay if it gets a little bit slippery too. When you grab the egg with the icing, it kind of messes it up a little bit. Let's do sprinkles! How much fun is that Easter egg? And guess what you can do with it too. Haha, <laughs> I'll show you. Oh, there's a cap for the sprinkles. Haha, <laughs> it fell off before. I'll put it back on. Do you think this is good? I should have asked if it was good earlier because I'm almost done. It's not even a problem that we didn't boil the eggs. See? And look what else you can do with the egg with icing. Very crunchy. Wow! You can't do that with just an egg that's just died, can you? No, you can't. Yeah, the, the pacing is good, right? Let's check actually on our dyed eggs. And you know what you can do with Jello too? Mm. Um, reminds me of a nice sunshiny day. You don't want to be left out of the icing, do you? No, we don't. See, I know it. You want to be decorated with the icing too, huh? Yes, we do. See? You got sprinkles. Uh-oh. I'll clean up those sprinkles later, I promise. It's okay if you make a big fat mess, cause we always have brooms nearby to clean it up. Even if you run out of colors, you'll still have some on your fingers from all of the icing and the sprinkles. And you rub your hands all over the egg. And, oh, uh-oh. That's why it's normally hard boiled. It's okay. Mistakes make the greatest surprises. Wow! Now we have an egg covered in egg yolk. Ready for Easter. You want sprinkles too? Of course you do. Sprinkle dinkle. Does this one look unsettling because I cracked it? You think I should take the crack one off the plate? Yeah, okay. I'll take it off. I just thought, well, people make mistakes. Looks a little gross. I'll admit that. <laughs> wow! 
Wow! Fancy chef pleading because of the yolk. The happy surprise that you didn't know was waiting for you around the corner. Wow! Look at this egg. It's so ready for Easter. And so am I. I'll see you next time. I think you can stop rolling now because I don't have any more ideas for the eggs. And I'm all out of the eggs because I broke two. I think I think it felt good too. We did we did good.